Hey, what is going on guys? Today I am sharing with you my top 5 best Assetto Corsa car mods for the month of January. We have some amazing cars on this list from some classics, some road cars, as well as some brand new prototype cars. There is something for everyone on this list. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into this with number one. First up, we have the Lotta Revolution RS2, 185 brake horsepower, 160 newton meters of torque. It all weighs just 650 kilograms. This thing is a super light little prototype racer thing. It first came out in 2003, and it's been modified up to its 2006 variant. This thing raced in Lotta's very own championship in Russia. But overall, this car is super fun, actually, and it is very light and nimble, being only 650 kilograms. I think this thing could definitely be a lot of fun if you were racing it around online. I genuinely, like, wish I could, because I think you'd have some super competitive racing. I also really, really like the look of this thing. It might not be to everyone's taste, but I think it is really, really cool. And yeah, overall, an amazing mod as well. It also sounds just oh so amazing. You guys can find this one in the race department link in the description below. Next up, we have the 2018 Honda Civic Type R. I used this car in my Santa Monica video and there's a ton of you guys asking for the link to it. And I told you all to wait and here we go. This one is brought to us by Polycode. This, it does have a Patreon link down below, but you don't have to pay for it. This is a free mod. It's just in their first ever post, unless they posted something new. I haven't been on it in a little bit. But just scroll down to when you see a Honda Civic Type R, and in the bottom of it, there'll be a little download link, and it will instantly download. 320 brake horsepower, 400 newton meters of torque. It weighs about 1,500 kilograms. It is a Honda Civic Type R. This thing is like one of the fastest like road cars to lap the Norch Life, I think, or at least it used to be. So yeah, this thing is pretty decorated. I think there's a lot of people, especially the JDM fans, who like a Civic. So this will go great in your AC mod list. Plus, if you're into like Shitoko and things like that, this car will fit right in. You could find this one in the Patreon link in the description below. Next up, we have the 2009 Chevrolet Corvette C6R. If you don't know, this thing, like the C8R, is the race car. I think it is like basically the equivalent of GTLM, GTE nowadays. For the Corvette C6, this thing raced, of course, in IMSA. I guess this was a GT2 car technically back then. Raced in IMSA, didn't race in the WEC because that didn't exist in 2009, but it raced at Le Mans and things like that so overall this thing is very decorated 495 brake horsepower 550 newton meters of torque it weighs 1300 kilograms this car is an absolute beast and it is super grippy it genuinely caught me off guard how much corner especially low speed corner grip you have in this thing this car drives like it wants you to push it harder and harder and it is so so fun and such a rewarding experience when you get it right and plus it's a c6 for me personally i don't like the c6s a ton but definitely in its race spec variation i really really dig it and plus it's a v8 you can't lie those v8s the chevy v8s sound amazing you can find this one in the race department link in the description below Next up, we have the brand new BR Engineering BR03. This is actually an official mod brought to us by SMP Racing Esports. And the BR03 is a brand new-ish prototype. I think they released it in like 2019. But it's a really weird looking one because it's like a single seater. But it's also, it's a prototype. It is, it is not like an open wheel car. It's just a very unique design. This thing 
thing doesn't race in anything international, I don't believe. I think it's just stuff in Russia. But overall, this thing is super cool, and it's really nice to have an official mod by the SMP Esports team to bring this over to AC. 420 brake horsepower, 465 new meters of torque. It all weighs just 850 kilograms. This thing is track ready, and it is so, so fun. Just like the Corvette, don't underestimate how much grip this car is. Don't overestimate it as well, but definitely don't underestimate it. And another one like the Lada, I think this thing would be so fun to race online. I don't know what esports SMP is hosting, but uh, fair play to anyone racing in it and have fun because this thing is going to host some competitive races, I'm sure. You can find this one in the race department link in the description below. And finally, number one on this list is the Chinook Mark II Can-Am. This 60s little prototype, I guess, raced in the US RRC and Can-Am series in the prototype class. It's from 1966, and this thing is insane. 376 brake horsepower, 475 newton meters of torque. It weighs 710 kilograms. Those are crazy numbers for the 60s. That is like F1 levels of power. This car raced as a factory effort, but it was also dealt out to some customers as well, kind of honing in on modern day sports car racing. That wasn't really too much of a thing back in the 60s. So super cool little piece of history here in Assetto Corsa. And even if classic cars aren't your thing, I highly recommend you download this one just because of the sheer speed of it. You can find it in the race department link in the description below. So yeah, guys, that is all I have for you in January. If you guys did enjoy, a like and a sub would mean a lot. We have a ton of big stuff coming up in February. We have the iRacing Daytona 500 that I will be streaming, but we also have a ton of super, super cool mod videos as well as videos on some other Sims lined up. So it should be a super fun month. Thank you so much for the support on this one. We've gained over 500 subs this month. That is so, so insane. Welcome to everyone who is brand new and thank you for watching. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good one, guys.